Alright, and welcome back to Randomly Generated Name Fun with Ryan Acid Heads Murphy. So, we're back to the fill in the blank type of one here. And, uh, you know, I'm planning on making some more of these. I like this type of one because it leaves it a lot more open ended. You know, it's just coming up with the, the you know, the lists of names and phrases and stuff to stick into the different uh, sections for the three different lists that I can put in. If you have your own ideas for lists, don't forget, if, if you know, if you haven't watched any of these videos before, I can have, th I need three lists of words or phrases or things. Spaces don't make that much difference, um, just as long as they're in a nice, neat list, because then I can just go through my little process of getting them in the right uh, format for the script, and then off I go. So you can uh, leave suggestions for uh, lists, you know, for generators of your own that I can work with to do uh, even more of this sort of stuff with, come up with new ones. Okay, all that crap out of the way. For everybody else who has never watched any of these before and you're still watching now wondering what the hell the point of this is, I always like to start off with an introduction, try and make it as quick as possible so everybody else doesn't have to sit through ages and ages of me talking before we get to the point of this when they've already know what the point is. They've already heard it before. And I'm failing horribly because I'm a rambler. I'm a rambling, 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 rambling man. Look it up, Steve Martin. Rambling man. Rambling, 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 rambling man. Okay, introduction. So, what I've got here is a random generator that comes up with randomly generated names, as I'm sure you guessed. And in this case, like, this one, it throws up something to start with, and then just the t a type, it's a blank, it could be anything of the Burning Soldier. That's what it happens to have thrown up here. I thought, the gritty blank of the Burning Soldier, that doesn't sound all that interesting, this is a good placeholder to start off with. When I hit this button, though, it's going to throw up a completely new, randomly generated name. It's going to be in a similar format. There's going to be that, that type there is a blank. So, what you can do, of course, you can just laugh at it, because sometimes it throws up really funny-sounding stuff. Or you might think it's dumb. You know, I, you, know you have no... Well, <laughs> Reboot. Okay. You have no control over your reaction to it, of course. But, so, you know, you might th find it really funny or not. But, really the point of this is, you know, the little game, if you want, that I've got uh, running for all these videos, is that after I've hit the button and generated that new name, and you've laughed at it or thought it was stupid or whatever, whatever your reaction might be, in the comments section, you tell me what it is. See, that's where it'll get really interesting for everyone and even more entertainment and fun because like the gritty blank of the burning soldier that sounds kind of dumb but dick suddenly we have something that sounds really funny the gritty dick of the burning soldier <laughs> it's a dick joke you have to laugh the gritty dick of the burning soldier and suddenly you have something that is actually pretty damn funny sounding Okay, so it's that simple to take something, you know, the gritty blank of the Burning Soldier and turn it into something funny. So, in the comments section, after I hit the button, it'll come up with a new name. You tell me what it is. You can just, all you have to do is fill in the blank. That's as far as you have to go. Or, you can give a little description to it, too, because sometimes it comes up with stuff that, it that, that almost beg for an explanation, a description, something. You could even write a whole little short story about it if you want, because YouTube give you, gives you plenty of room to type your, you know, comments and stuff in. You know, plenty of room. You can be as in-depth as you like. YouTube has the space to allow for it. And that's part of the fun. This is all about exercising your imagination and just having some fun with whatever pops up. So let me stop rambling, being the rambling man, and hit the damn button. The Malfeasant type of the acrid arrow. The malfeasant or maleficent blank of the acrid arrow. So what the hell is the maleficent blank of the acrid arrow? You tell me in the comments. Thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Bye diddy bye bye.